Okay, everybody. I didn't want to do this because I think it's a stupid topic. What race was Jesus? Was he white or black? What color was Jesus? This is a psychological thing I will delve into here. Now, the image people have in their minds are included to some extent. I try to put an empty face there. I try to put a light there. Put a, a face there put a light. But the image people get is through popular media. You know, picture on the wall. And the Jesus with the blonde hair and the blue eyes or green eyes. Or the picture of the brown haired guy, you know, with the long flowing robes and long hair and beard. Or, uh, the black Jesus with the big curly hair. For one thing, any image, any image made by man of Jesus is a graven image, and therefore breaking the commandments and is a sin. Break them, destroy them, cast them in the fire. It's idol worship. It puts that image in your head of what Jesus is. And that's not who Jesus is. Never was. Jesus' racial collar was never mentioned in the Bible. For a reason. Because we're all God's children. And the reason there is racism is because people continue to look at others in categories. They want to clump them into this group or that group. You, you're this type of person. You're that type of person. Oh, they're black. Oh, they're white. Oh, they're red. Until we can start looking at each other as, Hey, I'm Randy. You're Dim Cat. Or he's him. Or he's him. Or she's her. And not look at them as, oh, they're black, or they're white, or they're red. We're going to have racial problems. White pride. I have Randy pride. I don't need a extra pride on top of that. I am who I am. You see the color of my skin. It's... Kind of mixed a little bit here. And the shape of my nose. That's different than the shape of your nose. Oh, I'm one of them big nosed guys. Oh, he's a big nose. We we gotta keep him away from us. Oh, he's got long hair. He's a long hair. Damn long hairs. Damn hippies. You categorizing people like that? You you you're the problem. Brothers and sisters. All this is doing is trying to cause a racial division of some sort. Both sides are back again.
What are you scared of? Are you afraid of differences? You want everybody to be the same? Identical? In the same category? With your category? Well, that's the category I don't want anything to do with. I am who I am. You are who you are. The argument is a dumb one. You know, if, you're, if you're black and you're proud to be a black man, well, good for you. If you're white and you're proud to be a white man, well, good for you. But you should first be proud to be a man. So far, I see nothing to be proud of. If all you have to boast for is the color of your skin. We are each capable of great things beyond our understanding yet. We have to get past the superficial. The superficial. delve into the spirit and the spirit of this argument is evil and, uh, I denounce it have a good day everybody peace love and understanding be with you